In a recent parliamentary session held on February 28, 2024, Singapore's parliament voted in favor of the budget 2024 following a comprehensive three-day debate. The deliberations encompassed various facets of Singaporean society and governance, with notable speeches from Deputy Prime Ministers Lawrence Wong and Hang Sui Keat, among others. DPM Lawrence Wong took the floor to address the concerns and queries raised by members of parliament, MPs, during the debate. He highlighted the government's unwavering commitment to alleviating the pressures of the rising cost of living on Singaporeans and introduced the concept of the Singaporean dream, emphasizing the administration's dedication to realizing this vision. DPM Hang Sui Keat echoed these sentiments, emphasizing the need for structural changes in Singapore's economy as it transitions towards maturity. Recognizing the challenges posed by resource constraints, he underscored the importance of implementing policies geared towards long-term economic growth. The parliamentary debate saw participation from a total of 60 MPs, each contributing insights and perspectives on the budget 2024. Among them were notable figures such as Nadia Ahmad Samdin, Rizwana Begum Abdul Rahim, Carrie Tan, and Louis Singh, who provided nuanced analyses and expressed support for various aspects of the budget. Nadia Ahmad Samdin, MP for Ong Mo Kyo GRC, commended the budget's measures aimed at mitigating the impact of rising costs on households while advocating for a collaborative approach towards addressing social needs. Rizwana Begum Abdul Rahim, a nominated member of parliament, NMP, lauded the budget as a fiscally responsible strategy with a future-oriented focus, emphasizing its inclusivity and relevance to all segments of society. Carrie Tan, representing Nay Soon GRC, drew attention to the importance of mental health and well-being, stressing the need for comprehensive monitoring and accountability in this regard. Louis Ng, also from Nay Soon GRC, emphasized the need to improve the quality of life and working conditions for migrant workers, calling for enhanced standards and protections to uphold their rights and dignity. Following the conclusion of the Budget 2024 debate, the Committee of Supply Debates commenced, providing a platform for ministries to outline their plans and funding requirements for the upcoming fiscal year. Scheduled to run until March 7, 2024, these deliberations play a crucial role in shaping Singapore's policy landscape and socio-economic development trajectory. What are your thoughts on the key points raised during the Budget 2024 debate? Feel free to share your opinions, like, share, and subscribe to our channel, 2230, for more insightful content on Singaporean affairs. Your engagement helps us create more informative and engaging content for our community.